Okay, so this is the first morning after the second day of my surgery. Um, I don't know if you were able to see it last night, but here it is, the day after, what it looks like. So, I mean, it looks like I got a pretty good amount of hair there. Uh, see how it turns out when it's, when it's all healed up and grown out. Um, uh, let me tell you about it. So yesterday I said I, I uh, threw up in the car. It wasn't like a big yak. It was just a little bit. It was a, almost like a dry heave, but a little bit of stuff came out in a plastic bag. Uh, luckily I had one. And, um, what was I going to say? Uh, after that little yak, I felt a lot better. Um, I'm going today again to get the bandages off. So I'm going to see the doctor. I'll let him know. Uh, see what he has to say about it. Maybe it was the anesthesia. I took maybe too much. I said uh, they gave me a little more than what they give most people because it seems it wasn't really that effective on me. Um, pain level wasn't that bad, and honestly, now I feel great. So it seems like any discomfort you do have is is usually shortly after the surgery, and then then you're fine. Uh, I slept totally fine today. Uh, I slept on my bed with a little donut around my neck. And, um, yeah, I, I had a great sleep. Uh, I slept a little bit on my side even. Uh, I haven't had any swelling. Um, back of my head is comfortable while sleeping. I didn't have any problems. Uh, top of my head is pretty comfortable. I've been spraying saline, and when the water or the saline hits it, I don't feel pain. Um, it is sensitive on top and the back, but, I mean, it's, it's, uh, it's still pretty comfortable. Uh, it's looking pretty good so far. I'm actually kind of happy already how it's looking. Um, you know, excited to see the hair grow out. Um, pretty excited about this actually. I've been looking online at other videos just to see the results, and I think uh, I think this is definitely a you know beginning. I don't know if this is gonna completely solve me being bald, but definitely a beginning, and I, I see potential in it. Um, like I said, I, th I feel the hairline is just a little too far back, but again, the more I look at it, it's, it's not so bad. And um, I'm thinking that, you know, in the future, if I want a closer hairline, I was looking at about maybe another 1,400 and 1,900 graphs to get a little bit closer, uh, which still isn't too bad. It's, it's still pretty affordable. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go to the doctors right now, and I'll let you know how that goes.